President was in Northern Illinois to celebrate the deal that ended the United Auto Workers strike. The agreement will reopen a Stellantis plant in Belvedere that was idled earlier this year. President Biden said he stood by the UAW as they demanded higher wages. He said the deal the union reached will set a new standard. The president also praised the American workforce. I know what we can do and folks are given half a chance. That's why I'm so optimistic about our future. We just remember who we are. We are the United States of America. There is nothing beyond our capacity if we work with Nothing, nothing, nothing. And you're making it happen. Biden's visit coincided with a ratification vote by the local United Auto Workers on the Stellantis deal. JT Siskowski spent all day in the Union's Hall in Belvedere, where the vote happened and has you covered on the result. The local union hall behind me for the United Auto Workers here in Belvedere was a hive of activity as dozens of workers came to cast their ballots for whether or not to accept this new tentative agreement reached between the union and Stellantis. Today's vote was approved by a wide margin. 81% of production workers and 88% of skilled trade members voted in favor of the deal likely due in large part to a provision that would see the local Stellantis plant reopened. Stellantis idled the plant earlier this year, laying off hundreds of workers. Under the tentative agreement, the plant would reopen in 2027 and begin manufacturing a new pickup truck for the company. The deal would also bring a new battery plant to Belvedere. Together, the two factories would employ well over 2,000 people. One worker told me that this vote is about reclaiming what was lost. Yes, I'm for the contract because it's unprecedented. That's a new word we have nowadays, unprecedented. And, um, and I'm ready to go back to work, you know, even though right now I'm in school, you know, while I'm waiting for them to call me back to work. So I'm keeping myself busy. The agreement also contains many other gains for the workers if it is adopted. That includes a $5,000 ratification bonus, wage gains of 11% in the first year, and more in the years after. But the deal also has its detractors who want the union to fight for further wage gains and a restoration of pensions that went away during the financial crisis. The president of the entire UAW called this deal historic and highlighted what it does for Belvedere and the surrounding area by visiting the plant Thursday with President Joe Biden. In Belvedere, JT Saskowski, 27 News.